Hi guys, welcome to another video and welcome to another haul video. I know I have been posting quite a lot of shopping hauls on my channel showing you a lot of stuff that I have purchased, but the main reason is that I am currently decluttering a lot of the stuff that I had. Um, I am going through everything, I am reorganizing everything and also trying to see what I have been using, what are my current needs, um, what other accessories I um, would like to get rid of and get them replaced. And basically what I am showing you are also shopping sprees that I have done over the past months and these videos were just waiting there um, to be filmed. So I thought, okay, I'm gonna just show you what I have got um, over the past months and also try to share with you some of the new accessories, colors, and quite a lot of stuff which I'm trying to change. One of the things that I have been trying to change quite a lot is um, also some things in my style. I'm trying to incorporate, for example, um, flat shoes, runners, um, just still keeping the style, but um, I used to have basically all my shoes only high heels, and now that I'm getting older and all the rest of it, I think I need some new things which um, keep me stylish, but still make me feel more comfortable. So um, I don't have a lot of stuff here. Um, some of the things I purchased them, to be honest, because I really like them um, and others, because as I said, I just wanted to incorporate some new stuff which also um, was about changing my style and the way uh, I use things and also the way I put uh, outfits together. So that is very important at this point. Um, I'm shifting, I can say, from the usual very classic type of style to more jeans um, and sweaters and more comfortable outfits. So. I am saying all this because I have purchased two particular things um, that go with my new style of outfits, let's call it like that. Um, these are these two boxes here, they have runners and these running shoes are very, very stylish. Are they called running shoes still? Because they are very dressy, I really like them and even though they are in the same style, I actually got two pairs. Let me focus a bit for you. Okay, so you see, I got one in silver and then I got another one in another color, which I'm going to show you very soon. As you can see, even though they are, I guess, you can still call them sportswear, they have these sort of uh, rhinestones and these uh, sort of triangular rhinestones and they are so so cute I really like them and to be honest they are at a very um, discounted price and I really like it so that's why also I got two of these pair of shoes um, the silver one can actually be uh, used with various outfits but then and this is because I couldn't resist. I had to get it in pink, <laughs> which is my usual color. I don't know. The more I grow up and the more I'm getting obsessed with purple and pink when I shouldn't because I'm supposed to be getting older and more mature, but I guess it will always be my favorite color. And this is a pink again. It's the same type of rhinestones as you can see there, but it's very beautiful. And to be honest, it is extremely comfortable. You can see the bottom part of it and it's so, so, so comfortable. And the shoelace, if you can call it like that, it's an elastic. By the way, what you will be seeing in this video has not been purchased online. So for this, I cannot actually give you any links. I'm sorry for that. But as I said, I did these purchase. I think, I think I went on this shopping spree a month and a half ago. And as you know, I was very sick and I couldn't film. 
So this is why there are all these uh, shopping hauls at one go being filmed and posted in between a video and another. But anyway, I just uh, didn't want to miss uh, sharing with you what I have purchased and also the changes that I am doing in my style, if I can just describe that. Um, and by the way, I have also purchased a couple of things that you will be seeing in the upcoming What's in My Bag videos. Um, I have a couple of pouches here, but I have also other stuff that I will be sharing with you very soon because I am already um, experimenting with some new bags for my upcoming What's in My Bag videos. So I'm sure that you will be liking them. In the meantime, here I have something that I know I will be using as my walking pharmacy essentials pouch, whatever you like to call it. And that is this one here. This is from Carpiza um, and it is a dark pink pouch, as you can see there. Let me just show you better. Okay, so this is a very lightweight pouch. By the way, it's faux leather um, and it is very, very easy and I think it will hold a lot of stuff because as you can see, the depth of the pouch um, is quite uh, wide. And by the way, it matches completely my nails. Oh, the color of my nails is exact. Um, the same as the pouch, but it was not intentional, by the way. Um, it has a zip pocket at the front of the pouch. And then you can see how much space there is in there. And if you don't need it or you need to take it with you, maybe... Um, while you're traveling and you just need um, an extra pouch or something like that, it's very easy because you can just place it in your bag, place it in your travel bag, whatever, and it is very, very compact and lightweight. Um, I'm trying to find as many pouches and pockets as possible um, to change the contents of my bag um, so that first the bag becomes more lightweight when carrying it, um, because as you know by now I do have a lot of stuff in my daily bag um, and so one of the tactics if I can say so um, that I am trying to use is first to review all the pouches and pockets that I have um, try to remove whatever is not an essential and then I'm also trying as much as possible as I said um, trying to find pouches which are very lightweight in their material because I can tell you the pouch and the pockets that we use make a lot of difference. Let me just give you an example. For example, if you just uh, use these type of pouches, they are, um, they keep the, the shape, they are very good as quality and they are also very strong. But when filled up with stuff, they end up being quite heavy and when you have multiple pouches and pockets in your bag, like I have, it becomes an absolute unnecessary weight to carry. So if you take this against this, which is fall leather, um, very soft material, it's very uh, more lightweight to carry this one rather than this one. Obviously, this is still a good quality and it's a beautiful pouch, but it's not that good to carry around every day, all day, like I do with my bag. So I am trying to find these type of pouches all the time. I have changed actually to some of the pouches um, that I have shown you in the past that were the marble look type uh, of pouches I have given multiple times the link to those pouches and a lot of you have actually liked them a lot and those are still a lot lightweight than all the other pouches that I have ever had. So this is also something sort of a tip that I am using when I uh, try to reconsider what I am carrying, um, what I have every day with me because I spent a lot of time out of the house. I need a lot of stuff with me during the day to retouch my makeup, 
usually I do have my laptop. I have also other stuff that I have to have with me um, because of my work. And so I need to reconsider every single time what I'm carrying, what I have, what's important and what is not. So another pouch that I have purchased, but to be honest, I have purchased this one because I liked it. Um, it had a, sort of a, how can I describe it? Sort of a label where it was placed on the shelf and it was uh, saying that it's a mermaid type of pouch. And indeed, the pattern and the way this sort of quilted style is on this pouch, it looks like sort of a mermaid style. I don't know, it gives me that vibe. And the pink is amazing. The pink of this pouch, I really hope that it is appearing um, beautiful as it is um, in real um, in real life <laughs> as I'm seeing it um, on camera because it's really, really cute. I liked it and probably it will be my next makeup pouch. Who knows? You'll see it in the next what's in my bag video for sure. Um, remaining on the same team, I purchased a matching um, mirror and I couldn't resist and this is also an extra. I got uh, another one into a different pink. This is a light pink but as you can see it has sort of purples. So beautiful but this matched completely my pouch. So this is uh, I purchased this um, because it matched this pouch and the other one because I liked the colors. Um, going on unicorns, because I love unicorns, I decided to purchase this beautiful, beautiful glittered um, unicorn team uh, sunglasses pouch. It's in white and pink and it's, can you see that? It matches my running shoes and I loved it too. So yeah, basically then I got a beautiful um, keychain here with heart. It has the blue colors, the pinks, um, gold, and the same pattern in pinks and blue. And I think it will be the next charm that I will be attaching to my bag. So I'm doing a lot of changes for my what's in my bags. Um, another thing, you see this? It will be replacing um, the pouch that I currently have. This is um, sort of a pinkish nude type of uh, wallet. It has a lot of compartments. Let me just show you. So first, when you open it up, it has this zipper um, compartment with another two compartments inside. Um, it has the same thing on the other side. You can see that. Another two uh, compartments inside this one. Then it has these card slots and then there is also more space here and more space here. So it's full of compartments and I really love having a wallet that um, I have a lot of space where I can put a lot of cards and papers because I do have a lot. I have a lot of everything and I need also to think about what I'm carrying in my wallet too. The last thing for this haul, um, this is something that was a necessity for work, but I still decided to show it to you. I have purchased these black suede boots. It has this beautiful, um, it's not large, it's a white type of heel. Um, it's sort of a halfway through between um, the very thin one and the very thick one. So this is why I like this because it's not too much, but it's still not too uh, thin either. And it's a half boots. It's not an ankle boot, however, because it goes a little bit up as you can see, but you see that? It's very beautiful and I needed um, one like this because um, I have actually removed what I had in the same style um, from my collection of shoes, I guess. And I can assure you something like this is so, so important for me 
um, for my office work and for all um, the business trips that I usually have. So I needed something which uh, I could use it with every outfit, that it would be stylish, comfortable, because as I said, um, it has the wide heel, so it's more comfortable than having a stiletto one. And at the same time, I liked it. I like the look. And if I'm traveling, I can just grab this, take only this with me, and I would have something that can be used with every type of outfit. So this is the reason why I had to get that. And again, it was at a discounted price. So I think I did a good deal for all the stuff that I have purchased because um, it was everything quite discounted. Um, whatever you are seeing here, um, I got them at a reduced price. So that was a good thing for my shopping spree. So that is all that I have got so far for this video. I will be showing you other stuff that I have purchased. But in the meantime, I hope that I have given you a couple of ideas, showed you what I am doing in the background by changing the things that I have and what will be in my next what's in my bag videos. But as usual, I hope you liked this video and take care. And until the next one, bye.